Well, welcome to another segment of Meet the Boilers. Today, I have the pleasure of speaking with the All-American, the freshman phenom, Dylan Thieneman. Now, does it ever get tired of hearing freshman phenom all the time? Uh, it does not, no, not really. <laughs> I kind of like it. <laughs> so, going into this freshman year campaign that you had, absolutely stellar of a season, did you ever think that you were going to have the season that you did? I did not. I didn't really like worry about it or think about it too much. I was kind of just like, kept my head down, just keep working week by week. In order to prep for this upcoming year, what kind of help do you have to such celebrate? Was it coming in early? Was it, you know, all the work that you put in over the summer? You know, what kind of help do you get to the level that you're playing at right now? I'll say it's definitely coming in early. I was able to get, get here early, get around the coaching staff, the new scheme. So I was able to learn the new scheme and play with the um, play on the field and then work with the strength staff, so that definitely helped me to get ahead. When you first got your first game against Fresno State, got in, got that big time interception, how did that feel? Oh, it felt great. <laughs> it was incredible. I couldn't even, I couldn't even describe it. But you could see after the pick, I didn't really know what to do. Yeah, no, you were just running down the field going like this. I pointed, I was like, here we go, so ball. After you got that one pick, it was that when you kind of decided that you wanted to break a bunch of records here, not only at Purdue, but just around the nation as well? Uh, I didn't really have a like defining moment. It was kind of just how far can I take it. So it was like how far can I can I go? What like what can I do to keep pushing myself to keep going forward? After having such a freshman year stellar campaign, where do we go from here? What what are your goals for next year? I mean, you kind of checked off a lot of boxes over here. So what are you gonna do from here on out? Right now, I think just just do better. So like in the off season, um, just gonna get my body back, make sure I'm right, and then. Once we get start ramping up again, I'll just put my head down again and just see how far I can take it. Thinking about the year that you've had, the support that you've had from like not only the fans here at Purdue and like the community, but from your family and your friends, um, what has that meant to you to see everybody just cheering you on every single step of the way, no matter what? It's meant a lot because they've, they've been behind my back. They've helped me um, throughout my football career. Just keep keeping me forward with my with my brothers and my parents and everything. Just keep encouraging me, coaching me up. And now to get where the level I am, I'm just very thankful for all they've done. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for joining us. And thank you for catching up with another Boilermaker.